Since we met last Thursday, we have made three additional arrests. The arrests connected to the string of ambush-style attacks on teens in the East Valley mounting tonight. Gilbert Police Chief Michael Solberg confirming today there have been 25 arrests so far this year in teen violence cases. Mr. Garrison, good morning to you. Good morning. The latest arrests stem from an assault back in December of 2022. Two of the suspects, 18-year-old Cody Costries and 19-year-old Gage Garrison, appearing in court this morning, accused of jumping another teen at a house party. Police also requesting extradition for another suspect connected to the case now living out of state. The majority of these arrests have come from information that we have received from the community. East Valley Police Chiefs and the county attorney are still deciding whether the group of teens they're calling the Gilbert Goons will be classified as a criminal street gang. If suspects are charged as gang members, it could add years to their sentence if convicted. We are still looking at that. Um, I will probably have some additional information to give you on that in the near future. Some victims' parents and community members have been critical of Gilbert Police over its handling of these teen violence cases, arguing the department missigned this group of teens was behind the rash of assaults. Police Chief Solberg defending his department today. It seems like the community, parents, students, even high school coaches, knew about this alleged group committing these assaults. Why was it that the police department, it appears, were kind of the last to know about it? The majority of the videos that you mentioned, the, the conversation that occurred online, that happened after Preston was killed at the end of October. The majority of the arrests that we made, these 25 arrests, the majority of those arrests were from videos we received in December and early January. And so I, I understand the confusion of all these videos are out there. How did we not know about it? We learned uh, as the community learned from when those uh, videos were shared after Preston was killed. Meantime, late today, we got word that a civil suit was filed in one of the teen violence cases in the East Valley, listing dozens of defendants, both teens and their parents. Guys.